Before we move on to the next section, we want to modify or edit this surface a little bit. As you can see that when it created the surface, and I highlight this boundary here, this tin surface boundary, you can see that it's added some surface in here. And it's interpolated basically from this data over to this data uh, over here. And we really have a boundary of our surface that we can use, which is this line right here, to remove this section of data. So this is bad data. We're not really going to work over here, so we could move on and not worry about it. But I do want to show you how to add a boundary to the surface to kind of truncate that information. So you can select the object or we can come over to the tool space on the prospector tab, expand surfaces if it's not already expanded, go to definition and you'll see boundaries here. And I'm going to select that, right click on it and select add. We'll give it a name. We'll call it outer OG. So it's the outer original ground surface. It's an outer type. We can leave the non-destructive uh, break lines checked. What this does is if this boundary line was crossing a triangle, it would actually cut it and clip it there. In this case, we, we really want to remove the entire triangle. So we're going to uncheck it though. Um, I think I said earlier a second ago to leave it checked, but we'll uncheck it. It's just going to trim out everything right to the end of the triangle. We don't have any arcs. If we did have curves in our boundary, then this mid or distance would apply. Basically, it would add additional points along that arc to trim out the, uh, the data, the triangle. So we're gonna really ignore it, leave it as its default, and I'm gonna click OK. And when I do that, you'll see how it triangulates this. Now you'll notice that it took the triangles all the way back to here. If I had left that, because this is the new boundary now, if I had left that checkbox checked, then it would triangulate right up to this edge and, and this boundary would follow that line, you know, exactly. But that just shows you a little bit of difference. Like I said, it's not going to matter. You can see down here it also, you know, we didn't really have any data over here. So it would have uh, kept the triangulation in this area, but we're not working in this area. So we're fine with that. It's not going to affect our numbers in any way shape or form and it's it's not critical because it's, it's just out here just gets rid of that stuff we know is no good 